so in the last presentation we did our seven segment display and we left that lecture at this point where we just discovered the values of a b c d e f and g which are definitely our segments for the different numbers that we want to show now the next step of r is to develop the function for this a b c d e f g by using the values that we have discovered in the last presentation and what and, and how we are going to do that we are going to do that by the k map so let's do it i will copy this result or you can say that the output for a i will copy it copy and then paste and i will move it to the k map this is where i have made the seven k maps okay and this is our seven segment display decoder lecture number 2 so this is the value for your a so let me write it down this this, this k map is for a okay now we will fill the map for a 1011 is the four first elements so 1 0 1 1 then we are having 0 1 1 1 so 0 1 1 1 8 is 1 and 9 is 1 so 8 is 1 and 9 is 1 and as i have told you in the previous lecture that 9 onwards that is 10 10 11 12 13 14 and 15 we will take them as the don't care so i will put a cross here which represents that it is a don't care and uh, in the don't care chapter when we studied i have told you that when we are combining the ones we will consider this cross as one and we can combine it with the one which which means we can make the group by including this with one so let's move to our grouping the first group that i can see is this one in which we are having the eight ones and uh, it is the group of 8 1 then and let's say it is the first implicant then the second group the second group is this one it is also having the 8 ones it is the second group then we are left with the two ones this one and this one i will combine this one with the this one and this don't care and then this one it is the group of four ones so let's give it name 3 now we are having only one one left this one and we will combine it like this so this is our fourth implicant now the next step is to write the function for a so the first group gives us b3 the second group gives us b1 the third group gives us b2 bar and uh, b not is not changing it is complement then it is b not bar and the last group that is our fourth group gives us b2 b2 and b not b not and this is your what b not x nor b2 so this is our a similarly we will do for b the b segment so this is our b segment this one so i will copy it and paste to the other k map copy and then paste so let's take it to the next k map and we will combine for the b so this k map is for b now the first five elements are high or we can say it is 1 so let's make the first five element one which means 0 to 4 it is one so one let me change the color 1 1 1 1 and then one then we are having two zeros so 0 0 7 is one 7 is one 8 is one and 9 is also one 
and the rest of the shells will have the don't cares now we will do the grouping this is the first group in which we are having the eight ones now these two ones I can combine like this okay and uh, this four ones will be combined like this okay now we are left with this single one and uh, I think the best possible way to combine this single one is this okay I think it is clear to you now the next step is to write the function B so B is what the first group gives us B3 the second group this one gives us B1 B0 the third group this group of eight ones gives us B2 bar and the fourth group gives us B1 bar B0 bar okay if if I uh, do some mistake li like in groupings uh, maybe I have not made something which is the greatest possible group so you can do it because you have already learned about the kmap i'm just explaining you how to get the decoder in the seven segment display so there is no problem in that now this is our b similarly we will try to find out c so let me copy and paste the output c so copy and paste actually my hand is away from the keyboard that's why I cannot use the shortcuts that is control C and control V okay so let's do the fillings in the shell 1 1 0 1 then we are having 1 1 1 1 and 8 and 9 are also 1 the rest of the cells will have the don't cares so let's make the group the first group and uh, the second group the third group and the fourth group okay so quite quite having a large group of ones so the function will be very much simplified this is C sorry so C is equal to what the first group gives us B3 the second group gives us B2 the third group gives us B1 bar and the fourth group gives us B0 so this is C Similarly, we will do the K map for the D, E, F and the last one G in the next presentation. So see you in the next one.